What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. So today we are talking the one, the only, Legend London. If you're in the fit fashion niche on Instagram, I'm almost certain you've heard of this company. They're really making a name in the fitness realm for having very comfortable jeans that fit. If you guys have been following me for a while, you know we primarily talk active wear on this channel. We really love comfortable leggings, comfortable fits in general. I also really love fashion, especially around the fall and winter time. Sometimes I'm just over wearing leggings and I wanna spice it up wear actual cardigans, jeans. So here I am today to test them out for you, let you know what to expect with this brand, whether they hold up in the actual fitting realm, and to showcase the different styles and colors that they do offer, because I'm just letting you know right here, right now, we have a pretty generous haul. So a huge thank you to Legend London for sending these pieces out my way and for sponsoring today's video. So Legend London is obviously a UK-based brand. London, legend London. I've never been to London, but I want to go to London. They are a fashion brand. They, they, they do more than jeans. I'm actually wearing one of their bodysuits right now, but they primarily focus on jeans. While I was browsing their site, I couldn't help but notice something. Something very different from what I'm used to when shopping for jeans. I noticed that each and every one of their women's jeans were all the same price. So I'm looking at $63 USD, which if you're looking for a decent pair of jeans, you would know that's really good. I think they go from an extra, extra small to an extra large, but I will make note that it is in UK sizing. So at first I was like, not really sure what my size was until I looked at the really helpful size guide. Then I came to the conclusion that I was in fact an extra small. So even though I bought everything in a UK size eight, that translated into a US size four, which equals an extra small for me. So keep that in mind. Everything you see in today's haul is in fact in an extra small US four UK eight. According to their website, they do have three different styles of jean fits. You're looking at the spray on, which is pretty much a body glove, second skin type of look. A skinny fit, which is a little more relaxed than the spray on. And then a slim fit, which is the most relaxed of them all. Every single popular jean style we pretty much have covered in today's haul. We have mom jeans, which are making a huge comeback right now in this very moment. We also have distressed bleached skinny jeans, of course, because that'll never go out of style in my book. So if you guys happen to see anything that catches your eye, I will have Legend London's website linked down below in the description box. And if you love me, you can use code Ashley at checkout. It doesn't necessarily give you a discount, but it does let Legend London know that I sent you. So let's go ahead and try these babies on. Okay, I am now officially a part of the mom jean club. Mom jeans have taken over right now. They're so in style and I'm not gonna lie, when I see it, I'm like, that looks comfortable and I want you. So these are their mom jeans in the vintage blue wash. I kind of dig the retro look. So these are giving me total 90s vibes, especially because right here you can see there's a little more of a higher cut leg here. So I'm only five foot three and as you can see, they come right at my ankle bone. I think my extra small was absolutely perfect for this. You have just the right amount of hug here around the waist without it digging in. You have all real pockets right here. I have to make mention of that because there's some jeans out there where you get them in, you're all excited, and then you realize the front pockets are fake. <laughs> you can't use them, but these are all real. It makes the booty look cute too. Even for mom jeans, okay. You just want a little bit of that mommy got back look. My biggest pet peeve with wearing any jeans is the digging around the crotch area. That gets me more than anything else. I, I can't even explain it to you. These are not doing that. They actually give a nice roomy feel right where it matters. These are ultra comfortable. It doesn't feel like I'm wearing jeans and that to me is always a good thing. Being as these are looser fitting, they don't have as much of a stretchy material as you'll see with the more skinny fits. Those are the ones that have more of the elastane and the lycra. These are mostly cotton based. So I don't feel like you really need as much stretch when it comes to looser fitting jeans like the mom jeans because you still have room to move in them. Okay, let's take a look at their black skinny jeans. So around October and November, that's when I primarily wear black skinny jeans. They're staple black jeans that'll go with anything. I feel like this is just something that every gal should have in her closet. They modeled it on the site with a pair of heels, which 
would look really cute and classy, except I can't wear heels. <laughs> But I do think that these with a pair of gray boots over the knees would look really, really adorable. And this is an example of what I mean about the stretch. So for example, this one has a lot more stretch than the mom jean that you just saw. Both are very comfortable, but this you could totally feel it. This one needs stretch because it's so tight up against your body. But look at this, baby. Mm, I'm getting down with it. I'm getting real down with this skinny jean right here. <laughs> I feel like the waist right here is perfectly sized. It cinches in to give a flattering look, but it's there's no digging. Like when I'm bending this way, I don't feel it going, put it this way. If I would have to take these off to eat a cheeseburger, then I simply, they're simply too tight. And these I would absolutely eat a cheeseburger in, okay? So I wanted to get a pair of mom jeans that had a little bit of that distressed look. It depends on the mood of my day. Do I wanna go classy, no distress, or do I wanna show a little bit of skin and a little bit of sass <laughs> and a little attitude, a little personality? Well, this is where these come into play. I love how they kept the integrity of the glutes <laughs> when constructing these jeans, because even mom jeans, you still have to look sexy, in my opinion. I actually really love distressed mom jeans because the jeans that I'm used to wearing that have holes in the knees, they're a little too tight and they make my skin just pudge out of them uncomfortably. And it's just one of those things that I try to avoid. So I like having a little more of a relaxed fit when it comes to a distressed look, just to avoid any of that sausaging. And real quick, cause I know I'm gonna get questions. I am wearing the Legend London bodysuit. I feel like bodysuits are the perfect mix with a high-waisted jean because you avoid any bunching around here. It gives you a nice tucked in look, but you can still move around and do whatever the heck you gotta do without it coming undone or looking sloppy. Okay guys, so now I have the washed gray skinny jeans, but these are the spray-on skinny jeans. So the ones that are most form-fitted to your body. There's really no let up anywhere. There's no bagginess. Literally like the name implies where it is pretty much sprayed onto your body. These staple black jeans that I wore just before are just the regular skinny fit. These are the actual spray-ons. So far, out of all of them, the spray-ons have my vote. They are a little bit softer, just a tad. I'm feeling the difference right now. These have a little more of a rougher texture. The spray-on has a tiny bit more of that softness that I like. So even them being spray-on, they are extremely body fit. Hugging those curves really nice. They're still very comfortable. Again, these have more stretch than any of the mom jeans do. But even though these are spray-on skinny jeans, these I can straight up work out in. Like, look at this, ready? Okay. They're very stretchy. There's something so fun and rustic about a pair of washed jeans. So it gives a little more of that earthy, raw, real, like it's sun-dried, like it's been washed one too many times. Like you, you wore these a thousand times because they're your favorite pair of jeans, that kind of look. So, so far I'm noticing the sizing is very consistent. The overall fit, like right around my waist area, super consistent. I wouldn't even size down, I wouldn't size up. I think the size guide was spot on. Glute game, going strong in these, it's as close to leggings as you can get, but being jeans. I would say if you are somebody who swears by leggings, active wear leggings, you wanna switch it up and wear some jeans, maybe try the spray on. I think you might like it. It's got a ton of stretch in it. You saw me, I just did a full on split, all right? Wouldn't have been able to do that without ripping my pants if they wasn't stretchy. Ooh, okay, I think that this and the washed gray are my two favorites so far. These are the indigo blue high waist skinny jeans. These are the spray on. These are distressed. They have two really massive knee holes right here. Even with these being a spray on skinny, I'm not seeing any sausaging right here. <laughs> That's awesome. Extremely comfortable. It's like, it's like as if they knew to leave a little bit of let up right here. That's what I'm talking about, thank you. I really love this indigo blue color. It's a right there smack dab in the middle kind of shade. It's not overly dark, but it's not too light. It's right there. I'm also seeing a little bit of a washed out look right around the glutes. Kind of giving some dimension to the body, the booty. So yeah, these are doing the job right in the glute department. The waistband's nice and form-fitted, but yet like 
there's still a good stretch. See that? Wow. I am pretty sure this is my first ever pair of baggy jeans. What are you guys thinking? This is so retro and I'm kind of here for it. It is not supposed to be tapered or form fitted in any way. However, I do really love and respect the fact that they kept this waistband very true to how it's been. So even though the rest of this jean is very, very, very much on that extra baggy side, something I'm definitely not used to, it's still kept really nice around the cinched waist area. This is straight out of a 90s skate park. Like I'm about to just go to an Avril Lavigne concert maybe. I think the booty still looks pretty decent as well, okay? They didn't make this too baggy. Overall, I think that you could get away with sizing down in these in particular. You still have a little bit of that stretch like all the rest of the jeans. However, I do think that they're a bit on the long side here. So they're going underneath my heel. So yeah, I think you could totally cuff it up and give it a little more personality that way. But overall, these are the one pair of jeans out of everything you've just seen that I would suggest maybe sizing down if you want a little more of a form fit and not so baggy. And since I'm on a mom jean kick, you know I had to grab it in a black color, but not only that, multi-ripped. Check this out. If this is an ultra distressed, this is giving me Halloween feels. Anybody else? So this is a really unique style. You have three different types of distressed holes on the one side of the leg. And then the other side, you have two bigger sizes. So it kind of balances it out. There's no holes going on in the back, nothing distressed going on back here. A big thing I really love about the mom jeans is that the ankles are not tapered in the way where it's hard to get on and off around your foot. None of these jeans were difficult to get on by any means, but it's just worth noting that when you take off skinny jeans, sometimes you gotta do a little bit of pulling, whereas the mom jeans and the baggy jeans, you don't have to really work for them at all. All right guys, so we were looking at the skinny jeans in azure blue. If you want a straightforward, clean cut blue jean, this is it. This is as much of a staple blue jean as they come. There's no frills, no distressed, very, very much straightforward. This is not the spray on, this is just the skinny fit. And before I forget, I wanna make mention of the branding that they have going on. So you do have the Legend logo right on the button here. And the other branding they have is right on the back of all of their jeans. It's a black leather patch right here. So now again, I haven't washed these, these are brand new. So keep that in mind. These may shrink, they're 96% cotton and about 4% lycra. So you have an insane stretch. I wanna give it some room. If I wash it and it shrinks a bit, then it just might be a little more tighter on me and I don't wanna take that risk. I'm sticking with my true size, extra small. All right guys, so that was it. That was the full Legend London review and try on haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and found it really helpful. My overall final thoughts on Legend London. Between the price point being consistent and even trying them on, I could feel the major consistency in the sizing, the length, the quality. There was no jean out of here where it was like polar opposite and I'm like, what, is this even from the same brand? <laughs> it was very, very consistent. So uh -huh. consistency always has my vote. The quality was there and $63 for a pair of jeans. I mean like, for good quality jeans, that's really hard to find nowadays. And I think they were really flattering. Overall, I know, I know that the major thing that us gals care about is does it look good on a peach? And I think they definitely nailed it. Again, if you guys have any questions, always feel free to drop a comment, DM me on Instagram, and we can chit chat about it. A huge thank you to Legend London for sponsoring today's video. I can't wait to see what they roll out with next. I hope they really expand crazy hard because so far they're making my honor roll right here. Definitely give them a check in the description box. And don't forget to use code Ashley to let them know I sent you. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you all so much. I'll catch you in my next video.